it's a time to really look back and see how Chesterfield came about. I really want people to realize that Chesterfield is a great county, has a very rich history, a lot of progress has been made since the time I grew up, which was in the 50s and 60s. Well, the biggest changes, um, of course, is the diverse population. When I grew up, it was during segregation. So, of course, there were pri primarily um, African Americans and whites. It, we were segregated, but it was a different lifestyle. The community was self-sufficient. Um, people worked together more. The families were larger. See, most of the families, there were five or six children in each family. So they worked together also as communities. There were community activities. One of the things I remember growing up that are really um, felt dear and near to me were places that we visited, like um, Pocahontas State Park. That was a place that we frequented. Um, we went swimming there, we went fishing. There was the county fair. Of course, they had the colored fair and the white fair. Chesterfield has played a major role in the uh, history of not only Virginia, but the United States. And many people have come here to Chesterfield to live and are amazed at the history. And so I think um, when we think of history, we need to really realize the very beginnings and the impact that it has made on just the growth and uh, success of our country. I feel that there, the libraries, the schools now provide so much information for not only the young people, but the adults, the seniors. There's so many opportunities to just experience the rich life that um, we all want to live in our lives, wherever we are. And Chesterfield, I feel, is providing that now.